Glinda Dames Fincher has lived with sickle cell disease all her life. As part of her treatment, Glinda receives regular red cell exchange transfusions, two pints of red blood cells each month. Before Glinda's transfusion, she must be weighed and have her vitals checked. After check-in, she leaves for the treatment room. Before Glinda receives her transfusion, a nurse must remove approximately one pint of blood. This is to avoid an overload of iron when Glinda receives her transfusion. Glinda received her first blood transfusion more than 20 years ago. At that time, they didn't know exactly what it was, but it was an acute aplastic crisis where I had no blood, it wasn't pain, it was, I passed out. Without donated blood, sickle cell patients like Glinda face sickle cell crisis and other complications such as strokes, organ failure, chronic wounds, and shortened lifespan. Glinda is now a staunch advocate for regular blood donation and the importance of a diverse blood supply. Almost everyone eventually will need blood or know someone in their family that needs blood. So, uh, and with sickle cell disease, it is primarily in this country in those of African and Latino descent. And when you get a lot of blood, you may begin to get antibodies. So we need to uh, screen for blood for sickle cell patients, uh, need to have blood that is predominantly from people of African descent that have those same type of antigens so that they don't get a transfusion or at least lessens the risk of a transfusion reaction where you begin to reject the blood and no longer be able to get blood. Sickle cell disease is the most common inherited blood disorder and approximately 100,000 people in the U.S. have the disease. There are an estimated 100 million carriers of the sickle cell gene worldwide, which they may pass on to their children. More blood donors are needed now to help in the treatment of sickle cell disease. Join the American Red Cross and give blood to ensure patients like Glenda and so many like her have the life-saving treatment they need. Thank you.